It's your boy World CV here, back again with another video. If you're new, you know what to do. Make sure you hit that like, comment, subscribe button for more content on the daily. And today, we're going to be talking about a small little NBA trade that happened but could have big ramifications down in the future. So there was a three-team deal in which the Boston Celtics acquired Bull Bull and P.J. Dozer. Nuggets received Brian Forbes and the Spurs received Jonko Junko Horman Gomez. I Apologize why I mispronounced that. A 2028 20, second round draft pick from the Nuggets and cash considerations. Now, this move comes no surprise as Bowl Bowl has wanted out of Denver due to the lack of playing time. And Coach Mike Malone not really know how to use him. Again, he's a seven foot what four, five center who has handles, could shoot the three, very skilled, fits well into today's NBA's game. And this is the second time Bowl Bowl has got traded in 10 days. Obviously, the first trade he was traded to the Detroit Pistons but that deal was nixed because Bowl failed his physical and we know why he will be out 8 to 12 weeks after electing to undergo some type of knee surgery don't know the specifics of that but obviously it is something that is going to keep him away from the team from basketball activities for a good amount of time but Boston kind of needed a deal like this Especially this is going to rejuvenate the Celtics' young core of Tatum and Brown because there's been some talks about possibly breaking up that duo. You know, Boston has been struggling this season, really up and down. They're sitting about 500 at a 23-23 record. All the analysts have been saying, well, it's time to break up the duo because Boston has regressed in years. I was seeing 2018, they made it to the Eastern Conference semifinals. And then 2019... They didn't really go further with Kyrie. They actually got eliminated in the first round. And so you expect the team with a young core of Brown to kind of be progressing, not regressing. So this move, when Bull Bull is able to get healthy and get back on the court, it is nice to see a Brown, Tatum, and possible Bull Bull trio. You know, it sucks that we're not going to see a Cade Cunningham Bull Bull duel in Detroit. But hey, you know, things happen for a reason. So I believe that this deal will work out for the best of both parties and can't wait to see Bull Bull down the line. All right, guys, I said thanks you for listening and watching. Subscribe.